The city of Dryden has received provincial support to fix its library's leaky roof. Ontario's Minister of Northern Development was in the city this week to announce over $133,000 to help maintain the structure. Justin Hardy has the details. The books in the city of Dryden's library have been threatened by rain due to a series of leaks in the building's roof. New provincial funding will see the entire roof of the building replaced, as well as the installation of a new air conditioning system. Kenora Rainy River MPP Greg Rickford, who serves as the province's Minister of Northern Development, says services like libraries are crucial in smaller communities, and he's happy to be able to help through the Northern Ontario Heritage Fund. In the post-modernization of the NOHFC, we've really been able to target uh, small community assets that mean the world, uh, not just to the to town or city, but to surrounding communities. And the Dryden Library is, is perhaps one of the best examples of that out here in northwestern Ontario. It's an amazing building. They offer an incredible array of services and programs. And to be able to offer those programs and services, you've got to have the building to do it. Most of the leaks the library has experienced have been relatively small. Caroline Goulding, CEO and Chief Librarian of the Library, says that the funding comes just in time to prevent more major leaks that could devastate the books in the building. Thankfully, no books have been harmed, um, and we're really, really grateful for this project because obviously we want to make sure that that continues and everything gets fixed ahead of there being any major leaks. And then we're also getting a brand new HVAC unit, which I am very grateful for um, because our current one has started to go down anytime we get a thunderstorm. So <laughs> I am very excited to get this new unit installed and we're very, very grateful for the support of NOHFC. The funding is in place, but there is currently no timeline available for when the project will start or when work is expected to be completed. Justin Hardy, TBT News.